Football is the most popular game around the globe and is played by people of any age and gender. Besides, football has rich history. Games with a ball that was made of animal skin have been widespread in all continents since time immemorial. When it came to think about future profession, Bahit Masudov wasn't pondered. He knew he wants to become a football player. The Soviet and Kazakh former player of the national team of Kazakhstan trains young generation of players now. Bahit's parents came to Kazakhstan from the Chechen in Gush Republic. He is the third child in the family. Jambul city, where he was born, was once known as the city that provided some of the best players of the legendary football team Kairat. Children from my yard were always outside playing and running. I was the youngest among them, and my brother would always take me with him because he couldn't leave me home alone. Seeing these kids from the yard was the first time I saw someone playing football. At first I was kind of scared to participate, so I was just watching others playing and some time after I started to play with them too. I went to a sports school for children in Jambul. It was a great school, and in 1976 I was invited to the football team called Jambul Chemist. Competitions in Volgograd back in 1968 brought 24 teams from all over the USSR. The football team Chaika from Jambul was one of them and was named as the best football team among the players in their own town. That fact gave them an opportunity to participate in the regional competition, where they were the winners. They also won the champion title in the national competition of the Kazakh SSR among juniors. Bahit Masudov grew up in a soccer city. He played in the finals of the biggest football championships. With that great experience, he went through a selection to the football team Jambul Chemist, where he was enrolled. It was a great feeling to actually train with the players to whom you were supplied the balls before. It was a great honor for us, young boys. We didn't expect this to happen. I joined the team and we became good friends. I was playing for Uzbekistani team Khorezm for a year. Then I moved to Kazalarta, where I served in the army. In 1979, I came to Almaty to play for the Kairat football team. Bahit Masudov played with his first match for Kairat in Tbilisi against the local team Dynamo. The Kazakhstani team lost the game with a nil to three score, but it was a good lesson for the young players. Masudov was lucky enough to play with the best football players of his generation, but to do so, he had to work hard and keep on training. The football fans valued his technique, a unique way of playing. When you beat such teams like Dynamo, Kyiv, Spartak, Zenit, CSKA, Donetsk, Shakhtar, it remains in your memory. Now these teams are giants of Russian football. And while the Soviet Union was there, these teams were the best, the champions. And to win them was a great honor. And for me, the greatest battle was a match with Tashkent's Pachtako. Mentor of Kairat football team in 1980, Igor Semenovich Volchok invited Masudov to his team, where Vahid became a team leader. In 1986, he helped the team to achieve the best results during the Soviet period, to win seventh place in the Premier League.
I know him since I was a member of the children's football club. At that time, he was already playing for the Kairat team. Of course, we wanted to be like them, like the players from the Kairat. I even remember how we were serving the balls to the players while being at the stadium. I know him as the head of the team. He was different from other players. He had his unique style and he was always the center of attention. And of course, all of us wanted to be like him because he was a great player and still is. In order to succeed, you have to work hard and train at any weather. And the coaches are always first in the line to work out. Вахид Масудов очень знаменитый человек в Казахстане. Просто я вам пример приведу. Вахид Масудов is really famous in Kazakhstan. When we are going somewhere, some small town, for example, like Mahdaral in the south. To get there, you have to take a five-hour bus from Shymkent. Folks recognize Vahid even in the streets of this town. They are coming to ask for an autograph or to take a picture with him. He is a true professional, very open-minded and kind-hearted. He taught us a lot of things, and as soon as he came to train our team, we became more professional as players. Masudov was invited to a training camp in Moscow in 1985. He scored a beautiful goal in the first game that was named as the best in the 49th USSR Championship against the Dnieper team from Dnepropetrovsk. Unfortunately, he was seriously injured in the second game and couldn't walk for several months. There were a lot of legendary players at that time, such as Blahin, Buryat, Dahaev, Cherenkov, Chevadze, Kupianini, Aganisyan. Playing against them was a great honor, and it also helped me to improve my own skills. We never stopped, kept on training, and of course we were really excited when 30,000 people came to watch us play. The entire city and entire Kazakhstan were supporting us. There were the times when Yevstafi Pehlevanidi was playing on the field with us. He was a really strong player. And every time we would come out and play, Anton Slo would say how great it was that Yevstafi was playing in our team. <laughs> Football players are moving from one team to another from time to time. Vahid Masudov was playing for the Terek team, and after that, he went back to the Kairat team. He played another two seasons as part of their team. His debut in the tournament of Central Asia was in 1992. Masudov was the team captain of the Kairat and spent 10 matches playing with them. In 1993, he started to play for the Dostek football team. He moved to Germany after that, where he was playing in two different football clubs. When Masudov came back to Kazakhstan, he became a playing coach of the Aktubinsk football club. Как бы то ни было, там футбол в Советском Союзе считался на очень хорошем уровне, там он был... Football of the Soviet period was at a very high level. I think that we left a significant trace in the sand of the football history, because people still remember us, and they also remember the time when we played. Winner of the Federation Cup, many-time champion, and a winner of the Kazakhstan Cup, Vahid Masudov, is a great football player, and he has something to be proud of. 
Я уже стал играющим тренером в команде «Достык». Потом год поехал, там поиграл в Германии. I became a playing coach when I was in the Dostik team, a year after I moved to Germany. And when I came back to Kazakhstan, I was invited to the Aktubins club, where I started to play and to train the teams. The age of the athlete is short, and at some point a sportsman realizes it's time to leave the sport and share the experience with the younger generation. Kazakhstan is a big country with a lot of talented youth. It is necessary to keep in shape, to be an example for them, and Masudov often goes to the fields to play with the young generation. He was also a member of the match between the Kairat and the Soviet national team ex-players. За ветеранов мы играем иногда вместе. Он, конечно, даже сейчас отличается своими данными, своими, своей умной игрой. Мне we play together sometimes, and even now he plays really well, with his own unique way of playing. I was fortunate to work for six months with him, when he was a coach of our team, and during those six months we have received substantial experience with him. With his guidance we played around seven games, and we did really well thanks to him. Guys, believe in him. He has a great authority. It is quite important for the coach. He gives us all his knowledge, his energy and his soul. He is a great player and he wants to share his experience with the others. Bahit Yunusevich Masudov traveled around the country as well as to foreign countries. He played in different football clubs. He was not only a great player with his own unique way of playing, but a great coach too. He began his coaching career in 1996 when he was playing in the FC Kairat. He also worked for Taras from his hometown, was a mentor for the FC from Karaganda, led the Vostok Alting team, coached the Aktobe Lento and Jetisu. Bahit won the Cup of Kazakhstan in 2009 and had taken sixth place in the Premier League by the end of the season. Masudov coached the first league team Vostok and brought it to the Premier League, then found himself in the team of the Central Army Sports Club of the Ministry of Defense of the Republic of Kazakhstan. Раньше мы ходили на его игры смотреть. Его судьба так сложилась, что мне пришлось с ним как в качестве как тренера, да, как коллега с ним э, тесно работать в одной команде. Конечно, у нас много было тренеров. Все приходили, уходили, что-то свое оставляли. Но э, Юнусыч. I remember watching his game, and now I'm working with him. Of course, we had a lot of coaches, and each of them left their knowledge and expertise here. They would come and go, but Yunusovich has a special something, has a spark. It is always interesting to work with this person. He is very open-minded and easy to talk to. I would like to continue working with him. In order to be good in football, one needs speed, strength, skills and years of practice. Vahit Masudov represents Kazakhstani football and he is one of the best players of his generation. Now he is sharing his knowledge and skills with the youth. Because of the popularity of football, there are a lot of young aspiring athletes who want to become football players. And if their coach is Vahid Masudov, they have a bright future in football career.